Let's do it. We'll make use of this um this newfound knowledge. Good picks too. It's like those are the two I would pair together if I was doing frost rapidity. But if I see something like Rockstar, I might change my mind. I don't know. Glacial Blade. I want the uh, I want the one where he charges forward. Also, maybe I should force Glacier. Let's force Glacier. Because Glacier is going to be like what we build this run around. Smoke Bomb for Invuln. We don't need Invuln. Um, in fact, I want Money Toss. Because this is like the... Um, like, there's a lot you can do with this that works with Rapidity. Like, there's there's a synergy between something like this and, like, the the general Rapidity build. Pay the doubters? Okay. I'll pay... It. Wait, you have a 1 next to your name, dude. What the fuck is wrong with you? Like, steal my points, even though the Believers won, please. And also, another Believers versus Doubters. Let's do it. And also, I'll hydrate. Hang on a second. I, didn't, I never hydrated earlier. Will Hexa win again? Yes. Huh. 30 minutes. Good luck. Get your votes in. Win some channel points. Okay. That water actually hit pretty well. Thief basic hits twice. Clown would have been better. Uh, no. Wait, no. Rapidity on Clown is horrible. Because uh, Rapidity is a close range attack. And Clown's like a mid range user. So, no. That's terrible. It's why um, Rapidity sucks on Hunter. Because, dude, he tosses his um, his things away. And most of the time when Ninja or Clown's attacking, you're, the enemies are out of range of Rapidity. If you're close range attacking with your Clown, you're doing it wrong. Move for the Glacier, dumbass. Is that better? Um, then, um, the multi-attack on, on Thief. And also, we're, you're wrong again, Lucas, because we're building Rapidity 4. Well, you're thinking in a vacuum. You're not looking in the context of the run, dumbass. L loser bozo. You're still wrong, though, because, like, it doesn't work with Rapidity 4. It's just worth it. Not on a Rapidity 4 run. Stop being so confidently wrong. Oh my god. Okay, the odds of that being a dupe were so low, and it still almost happened. Uh, we'll take a item room here. Calm down right now. No! Ah, let me out! Oh my god, I did it again. <laughs> god damn it, bro. Uh, yikes much? Any yikers? I'm yikesin'. Do we play for proc clown attacks? Yes, it does. But the problem with it is, is you, like, Rapidity 4 hits, like, hang on. Rapidity 4 hits about, like, this far from you. It's like a mid, it's like a close range attack. And Clown's daggers go to about, like, right here. And most of the time when you're playing Clown, you do not want enemies to be this close to you. It is bad. It's just bad. <laughs> like, it's, it's like, intuitively bad. I don't even know why you're arguing. Like, stop. You're being Dos Skull right now. And that is not a good thing to be. What was a moment I... Uh, Thief swapped into the fucking Brambles multiple times. It's a fair moment. That's why I didn't say anything. Because it's like, fair, you got me. That's a moment. Is Clown's hit and run playstyle? Nah, dog. You're just, like, being confidently wrong. I don't know why. 
I'm not saying it's unusable. I'm just saying it's it's like bad. It's literally it's just bad run building. Like it just it doesn't work. There's anti synergy. Also, that's like the best thing we could have gotten. I think. Hex it's clown. I like clown a lot. I think clown's really good. It's just not good for this run. If we're doing rapidity for it, which is the plan. That's like the whole reason we're doing this. Although things are starting to maybe look a little different now that I'm seeing this stuff. Also, Autor, I, this is a rapidity magic attacker. We have to take him. Or it's not rapidity, but he's a basic attacker. Yeah. The only issue is his basic attack is slow. But we're going to be using his basic a lot. And he's also a unique in Act 1, so. Uh, let's buy treasure. Ew, get that dark dork out of here. What? He has so many haters. And I, I don't even fully disagree with people who don't like him. I think there's a lot to dislike about him. But if you know what you're doing with him, he's like really good. He's like one of the most non-new player friendly skulls in the game. But if you know what you're doing, like I said, also look who it is. I like him too. Anyone who knows what they're doing with Dark Paladin can make him work, and he's good. But I do get why people struggle with him. He's very hard to use. Just Mana Tech 3, that's all. That's literally all. And even then, he's still hard to use, but that, like, fixes his literal broken jankness, like... Because there are... Also, look, we got freaking Glacial Field or whatever the fuck it's called. This is definitely a Mana Tech 3 run if I ever saw one. This is the most Mana Tech 3 run. You're uh, hard to use? <laughs> Good one, dog. Shit, dog, I didn't see that one coming. Damn. It's like I was even agreeing with you. Why would you say such a thing? I was in stark agreement, bro. Okay, not stark agreement, but but I was I was agreeing with you. Okay, what if we doubled the bone omen though? Actually, what if I deleted everything except the Raven's Monarch Feather and the Bone Omen? And we just rolled the die. I could even delete the Raven's Monarch Feather, but I I I like the item too much. I, I have to keep it. With you, Sly, you big goof. That's what's up. Oh my god! Oh my god! Heavens to Betsy! Goodness gracious! Gross? That's gorgeous. That's beautiful. How dare you say gross? That's probably the greatest thing I've ever seen. Sure, actually. Why not? It'll help. We are doing rapidity. Speak of rapidity. We need to build our damage up, so let's start fixing what we lost. Wait, what am I saying? We, we don't... <laughs> my damage is great. Like, I'm so used to building around inscriptions that I assume my damage would be bad, but... Like, we literally just have, like, the most dense damage scaling you could possibly have. Except for, of course... Mm, there's a couple items that contend with double bone omen but it's hard to contend with double bone omen imagine if i went omen three guys this is this would not be a good omen three run so i'm, I'm not going to do it but mercury hearts would make this run not fun oh my god pip and sly are arguing it's classic just just do go ape shit oh <sighs> 
I fucking hate Mercury Hearts so much. That completely fundamentally changes the run, by the way. Just so you know, I, it'd be very hard to go Omen or um, Rapidity 3 with an Omen run like this. Or Rapidity 4, I mean. It would be pretty difficult. I guess I could try, but I don't know if it'd be good. I guess we just have such dent, dense damage scaling that maybe I could just get away with it. This Yiggy's gonna melt like butter, by the way. This might be the world's most dead Yggdrasil. I'm gonna play Skull Blindfolded and win! They say pivot to status spam and mana attack? Who says that? Let me at him. I'll show him. I guess I'll take a Lunar Ring. Fuck it. Alright, guys. I've decided. I'm going Omen 3. I don't even need Collection of Desire right now. Yeah, I don't need it. Definitely can't go this here. It would be bad. Weakness Exposure is also not great here. What's good here? Go-Getter's okay? Go-Getter's good because I'm going to be using my Raven's Monarch Feather a lot. Like, a lot. This is pro it's probably my primary source of damage for for the foreseeable future. It's very important that I uh, swap as often as I can. Because like I said, these are both really bad Omen Skulls. I guess Frost is okay, but like... With Omen 3, you kind of tend... Like, I prefer long-range attackers, and Dark Paladin is not that. I don't even need to tell you that, but... Uh, E100% is not a long-range attacker. He does have a really good swap, and so does um, Frost, so. The real problem is Glacial Field will get me killed very quickly if I uh, if I use it at the wrong time, or it'll like, lose me Mercury Hearts, which is frankly worse than death. Made sense there, though. Silent Cries? Uh, I'm not, you know what, I'm going to say it. I don't think Silent Cries is good. I think that's DOS's worst take. Like, he seems to really like Silent Cries, and he always tells me to take it, even though you're not DOS, obviously, but like... It's not good. He thinks it's good, it's not. Second run of the day, third. Also, what's up, Izoka? Look at this run, Izoka. <laughs> you have shown up at an interesting time, Izoka. This is, uh... You know what? Let's let's grab the slime. Rare slime take. Oh wait, no slime will not. Slime will still lose Mercury Hearts, so maybe slime wasn't good there. But what's done is done. We have to hold on to it for the short term. Man, take woman and silent cries. Um. I mean, eh. No, I gotta focus. I gotta focus. This is gonna be the most stressful run for me. Like, I think this is, like, the anti-fun Haxer run, basically. We've, we've chemically, in, in a lab, designed the most unfun run possible for Haxa. But, um, at least it's cool and interesting. Busted, but Mercury Hearts, exactly. <laughs> That's the only reason I don't like it, for the record. Mercury Hearts. But here's the thing, right? This has the potential to be the strongest run I've ever done. Yeah, we're doing that clickbait again. But this time, it's real. If I can keep getting omens, this will easily... 
I think, be the strongest run I've ever done. Because I've never had double bone of, uh, 13th bone dupe. I've never had this. Pippin, uh, Sly are still going at it. Okay. Give me your legendary, please. That was just copium, but honestly, I felt that shit. I felt like she was going to give it to me. Was it with Bone Omen and two Master Beast Omens with Orc? Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. That sounds crazy. The only thing I'll say about that is... Let me check first. This has no ceiling. This has no cap. The Masterpiece Omen does, so this has the potential to be even stronger than that if I can just get Omens. Which, frankly, I should be taking item rooms, and also I'm losing Mercury Hearts. I hate Mercury Heart, man. Ugh. I need to play more carefully, and also I can't reach that very much on this run. This is why I hate this shit. Oh, there's a Dark Elite here. Disaster. Okay, let's be very careful. Okay, we're at five. I'm going to get rid of um, Glacial Field or whatever. Yeah, even if it means I lose the Iceberg, this run's changed fundamentally. I don't think we're even concerned about Rapidity anymore. We're, we're just concerned about building a powerful run, so. We don't need the Iceberg. We just need to get rid of Freezing Field because um, that shit's going to get me killed. I did not mean to press this button. We need to get rid of this Quintessence, too. It's going to lose me Mercury Hearts. Ten K physical. I think we can beat that, except without. Um, you're probably counting um, the orc, right? Because this is a magic run, so it can't get higher than that. Which is unfortunate. Can we just have Magic Orc already, please? I'm going to take this, actually. Give me Wisdom. This is... <laughs> you know, normally, these do almost no damage. But because our damage percent is so high... Okay, maybe I'm not cooking. They, they don't appear to still be doing damage. I thought maybe I was cooking there for a moment. I'm actually going to take a uh, item room here. In fact, I might not even worry about my skull. Uh, they're like... I'm, this might be a non-upgrade 2 to the legendary run here. Because um, I need omens. Okay, we didn't lose a Mercury Heart there, which is beautiful. Something like this would be nice. Could get rid of this, but it's my artifact. Yeah. Guess we'll just not. Take Revan Medallion? Uh, probably, yeah. I almost certainly would, actually. Or maybe I wouldn't. Because, um, we already have Wisdom too, and I like my Wisdom items. Okay, I'm actually- <laughs> I was cooking when I picked up the, uh, the after image. Holy shit. I was cooking kind of hard, actually. What about Wisdom 4 of even more? We need to find the Wisdom Omen, and then we can do that. Or, eh, we, we, we already have Wisdom on the pedestal, so... I guess I would take the Medallion then, because it's going to be hard to reach Wisdom 4 without it.
that was just freeze working against me entirely. Minus two. Okay, that is... Okay, I need to be careful about how often I use my skills. Let's just go back to the old drawing board of uh, using Raven Lord Medallion. Or, I mean, Raven Lord's Feather to uh, build the majority of my damage. Okay. We're at eight. That's still a, a solid number. We're gaining. I just need to get out of this Leona Sisters fight with... Um, with... A good amount of them. Fuck. Oh, disgusting. I should have been prepared for that. Okay, we're at six. That's doable. Though Act 3 is so much harder. Oh, man, that sucks. Losing, th like, three or four for no reason. Ugh, I fucking hate Mercury Hearts. This is good. This is the kind of shit we want. We just want, like, passive damage. Although, Nias is also worth considering. Basically, right now, my Quint button does nothing, and it's, like, actively bad to press it. I think I'm getting rid of this now. Rapidity doesn't matter anymore. This is much more important. Five omens. I want more than that, dog. I want to go to the moon with these omens. Shyness is great. And we'll consider collection desire at the end, just for even more damage, maybe. And it's only 100, and that's a drop in the bucket here. Now, I have a decision to make, because I did say I'm considering not upgrading my skulls. How much benefit is there to upgrading either of these? I don't think there is that much. I kind of get what I want out of them as they are now. And if that's the case, I'd rather just build up my Arachna Shrine. I think I'm going to do that. Glass Body. Uh, I don't. Th does Glass Body work with Mercury Hearts? I don't think it does. Based on what I know about Mercury Hearts, if I got hit during the iframe of uh, Glass Body, it would still take away a Mercury Heart. This is maybe the worst prefix for us on this run. Thank God we have the Raven's Monarch Feather. That's true, but I think Sly was talking about preservation of Mercury Hearts, but I don't think it works the way he wants it to. I lost one there. I fucking hate Mercury Hearts. Swap in the corner. That's my strategy as of right now. And also occasionally using my skills to bring out these. Like here, use a skill. Then swap. Minus one, ugh. Okay, I lost two there, I think. Okay. Seven, we've, we only gained one, which is not good. That means we're losing them. Unless I didn't fight a Dark Elite for a room. Can't remember if there was one room where I missed, like a Dark Elite didn't show up. Mercury Farts, true, brother. That's so goddamn true. Not even Mercury Farts, bro. Mercury Sharts. Maybe Fulgent Dawn Dreams Ago. This is another way to get to Wisdom. Or maybe I get rid of this. Actually, yeah, let's get rid of No, 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 wait, that's passive damage. This goes. Um, I do kind of want this.
Yeah, this goes. Okay. All right. Oh, no, I should have taken that item room. Fuck. My autopilot. Wait, how did I lose a mercury heart there? I swear to God, bro. Wait, no! My fucking coin button. Where did that even go? So we just gained zero in that room. Okay, it's a that's a money room. I'm, I have to turn off my autopilot, guys. Whenever I see a skull room, I need to pay attention to the room next to it. Which is probably the hardest thing for me. Okay, I need to stop pressing that button in general until I get mana tech. And even when I get mana tech, I should probably not press that button. I need to change my, But then all of the skills suck, and the only good skill on Dark Paladin is Dark Rush. If we're talking, like, quick animation skills. It's 110... Okay, you already said 110 percent He's in an attacking animation, so I need to be aware of that. Okay, I do not want you to ult here. If I can stop it. You two, actually. No ulting for anyone. Okay, that went super, super, super well. It's about as well as we could have hoped for. There's no legendaries here I want. Actually, his would be really good, but sadly he didn't drop it. It's like a rare time where I really want to see his... Because it actually stops you from dying with Omen. This is the only Arachnistron that matters. After this, all the bone shards I get can go towards upgrading my skulls. But getting that upgraded to me- Fuck! Fuck! Autopilot, bro. Mother. No, there's zero point in increasing my HP. It does nothing. Oh! Please be an item room. Okay. Autopilot disengaged, bro. Moving forward. This time for real. Wait, that took away a Mercury Heart? Get the fuck out of here. I despise Mercury Hearts, bro. Oh, you're a Dark Elite? He was moving around. I think it was just because of the... um. I, I, was, I just did not think he was a Dark Elite. Basically because of the... Um... Also, I need to use my after image more. I picked up that thing for a reason. What's a lot? I'm missing a lot of chat because I'm just so focused on this run. It's like, we're already... Like, if I don't get some omen soon, we're going to kind of even out on my damage. To where it'll be like the standard end of a run damage percent. And then we won't actually be powerful we'll be like about where we normally would be so this is good to see this is about what we need to see um we can just get rid of artifacts it literally doesn't matter it's like a very rare run where my um where my inscriptions are meaningless literally just like there's zero reason to care about them except for wisdom and uh courage that's it Okay, there's a Brawler Dark Elite down there. I don't know which... Oh, it's the big guy. That shit sucks. Oh, it's the little guy. Okay, we're at eight now. I 
I turned off the autopilot officially. Do you guys see that shit? That's what's up, baby. Okay, we're at 10. Nine. No omen. Nine Mercury Hearts is good. I need to keep these during this fight. Pot of Greed. <laughs> Does this even matter? I don't think Pot of... For one, how many legendaries do I even have? I have zero. Literally zero. It's the mo world's most useless Pot of Greed. Yeah. No, 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 no. We have one. We have one. But it still is useless. I'm going to break it. Pot of shit, bro. It's literally just a pot of, like, bubbling poop. I want to get hit with it? What are you talking about? Anyway, Dirty Smash isn't working the way it used to? Shocker. You know what? Never mind. Go on. Say it. What were you going to say, huh? We're waiting. I hate this. I hate this. Okay, I think we're getting after it with all of our Mercury Hearts. Beautiful. No, I'm good, buddy. No, no. Go on. You've piqued our interest. Say it. Coward. This is really good here. That's my Wisdom 4. That's my ticket to Wisdom 4. Could get rid of this, actually. Although, that's my Courage, too, and that actually matters quite a bit. Definitely don't get rid of this. It, actually, this goes. Yeah, this goes. Easy. Now, picking up Omens from here is going to be hard, because, like, all of these are building towards something. This can go. This can go. These are all pretty important. This has to stay. It's how I'm keeping my Mercury Hearts. But, like, we're set up. We're set up for um, only yours. I'm interested. I'm sure others are very interested as well. Look. Oh, God. <laughs> Do I test the fates? What if I pick this up and it's worthless? Because that's... The, here's the thing. No, here's the thing, Sly. It might not work the way you want. No, don't. I think I'm right. I think if I pick this up, it will still take away my Mercury Hearts regardless. It's worthless. It is worthless. It's worthless. Then tough luck. I think we take this. It's... Eh, hmm. I could also pick up something really weird. Something I never pick up. Coziness. No, no, no. That's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for... Where is it? I don't even know what it looks like. <laughs> Where's the thing that gives you shield per room? It's one of these. Below coziness? That's beast blood. No, this. Hard shell. Gain... 25 shield that's nothing actually 25 shield is worthless that's not even going to save you one hit in omen up to 25 hello that's horrible <laughs> okay never mind i think i just take something that's like reliable and good i'm just taking weakness exposure god that's dog shit man why would they make why they even bother making that like that's so bad that does nothing. Let's grab this. Stray garbage. The Fortress Sinaim is good. But the, the difference between that is it's not attached to a dark ability slot. It's like the Fortress Sinaim is one of the better sin items.
Dark Priest robes, it's effect, it's effect activates at too low health. It's good in normal though. Should have taken the should have taken putt putt. Fuck is putt putt. Disgusting. Why? Why out right out the gate this shit, bro? Minus okay, just minus one. That still sucks though. Right out the gate, I instantly get got by a fucking disgusting dark elite. Come on, man. Omens. Nothing but omens. Come on. My autopilot has disengaged. Like, I'm, I'm awoke. So just pay me. Pay me for not being on autopilot. Like, I deserve it. Dog, <laughs> please, man. <laughs> I'm awoke, man. I'm I'm literally awake. I've never been more awake in my life. Just give me omens. Fourteen mercury hearts, though, guys. It's looking pretty good. Oops, all omens. Not yet. I mean, we're doing all right in the omens department, but like we could be doing way better. And frankly, it's my fault for um, for getting to take item rooms for so long. But like, I'm awoke now. I deserve to be rewarded for not being on autopilot for once. Eighteen Mercury Hearts. All right, we're doing we're doing perfectly okay, guys. I think everything's going to be a okay. I almost did it, but I, I changed my mind at the last second. This is how truly uh, locked in I am, guys. You've never seen me more locked in in your lives. Everyone just got chills, right? You guys all just got chills. Like, damn, he is locked in. Bro! It's too late for that. Fourth of the day, Thief? Yeah, I guess we do owe Thief a redo, huh? I'm happy to do a Thief run. Cheats all the Mercury Hearts. He also is a Mercury Heart Eater, for the record. Minus one and only one, guys. We literally only lost one Mercury Heart there. Okay, I'm officially locked in. It's a fit. Like, you guys can't deny it anymore. You've never seen more me more locked in your lives. GG. It's looking pretty GG, huh? Like, you know, let's not toot our horns just yet, but it's definitely looking GG. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Wait, can I even... Okay, it doesn't matter that I can't awaken this. It's just stats. It's looking dumb. It's dumb as fuck. This run dummy thick. In the best ways. Okay, okay, stop, stop. Lanterns, stop. I'm trying to have a good time here, okay? More item rooms. 
Skull rooms? What the fuck is this? Oh, do you hear that shit? Omen! I heard it. I heard the omen. I'm not doing this foolish and large chest because I'm no fool. I'm going for the omen. Did you get an exorcism? No, but I probably should have one. <laughs> Sometimes it's just that easy. Sometimes it's just that easy. I think I'm going to go to Wisdom 4, even. I'm thinking it's Wisdom 4 time. Bro oh, wait, no, wait, maybe it's not Wisdom 4 time. No! Wait, what did I drop? I didn't drop Wisdom, did I? I hope I didn't drop Wisdom. You did? What did I fucking drop? Rapidity? Fuck! <laughs> okay, we gotta fix it. Please, bro. Dog, don't make me- don't, don't punish me, dog. Please. I'm even not gonna buy the purple flirt. I'm not buying purple flirt. Oh, I want the purple- I'm not gonna buy purple flirt. I'm not even taking the skull room. We're going for items. We're on that item mill grind set. I think I just lost- Oh! Oh my god! Would it- Okay, there's actually a chance if there's an, uh, a wisdom item in there that it's worth taking the wisdom item and not the, uh, cur or the, uh, the omen. There's- th That actually, I think, is a play that's worth considering. We'll have to see. But also, taking more omens is just cool. <laughs> okay, thank god. I'm taking the fucking- yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. One more. What's happening? Oops, all omens. It, it all came together at the last second, guys. How am I going to make this? Uh, this is the YouTube video, for the record. I don't know if you guys can tell. We already- so I now have two YouTube videos, two good ones too. This one's better than the last one though, by a long shot. Fuck! Give me wisdom. This is bullshit! Okay, I don't know if you're saying that in a bad way though, because you are a believer. This is- this is like a free- like, the believers should be rejoicing. I don't think it's ever been a, a stronger believer victory than right now. If I can't get Wisdom 4, I need to remember to change my pedestal. But also, keep in mind, there's two Joan Wisdom items. The odds of me getting Wisdom are huge. Yeah, Golden Hero for sure. What's my crit? 10? How am I getting this many crits? What the hell? I have 10 crit rate. Okay, I'll, I'll let her summon her orbs, even though I don't think it matters. But I could have stopped her there. Minus one, not a big deal. Here comes the ult. This is definitely a minus two moment for sure. Never mind. We got the iframes on deck. That's just. Joan's done with. She's now a cloud of red mist floating away in the wind. And also, that's my wisdom four. Now this can go. Now it goes. Wait, actually, did that change my damage percent that much? Wait, what? Huh? What? Look! Wait, okay, hang on. Okay, it's because we haven't activated it yet. We haven't activated it yet. Okay. I was like, where's my stats? Shut up. <laughs> Actually, I'm very curious to see what my stats will be. I think around like 4,000. I know, shut up, shut up. I'm excited. All right, let's do this then. Since we can't upgrade our Skull to Legendary. Let's get a little more damage in there. Okay. That's a, that's a good spicy damage percent. 
3,000. So not even close to Piplip's 10,000. I guess the seal, like, because this is like a high roll for sure with double bone omen. Turns out double um, masterpiece omen with orc, shockingly, believe it or not, still better. But this is good. Like, this is very powerful. We should be happy and proud. Now I can take the purple flirt. Okay. Here's the kit. Holy mother of God. It's just a ring of omens. And it, look, it's even like they got the two bones up here holding up the other. This is like a Minecraft craft or something. Like this is this is a some kind of weird fucked up Minecraft item that we're crafting today. Must have cheated. Uh, why do you even believe, dog? Listen to yourself. You're talking like your fucking streaming guy. Which, by the way, remember... Remember what I said before? The streaming guy and, uh... And Sly Mighty Owl overlap? I remember mentioning that shit. And look where we are now. They share a brain cell? Exactly. Multiple cursed chests. Well, that our king run earlier was just like, I don't know, man. That shit did not pan out the way I wanted it to. But this has panned out. Don't forget, golden hero. I won't. You're a doubter, Fuji. What the hell? Why are you doubting, dog? I thought there was a one next to your name the whole time. Yeah, this hero uh, not making an alley to this section. I can tell you that much right now. Physical damage on their own. That's true. Come a Chad for a day and lose points for no reason. It's like, I'll take those points. Let it be a reminder. Okay, I misused my subject. Fuck, I missed. Okay, he's gonna go instantly into phase three for the record. Yeah. Man, I was so close to stopping him. Had I not missed some of those attacks earlier, we would have stopped him before he goes even into this phase. We'll have to see how the golden hero stacks up to this. For the record, I don't know who was uh, here on my last stream. What up, Doss? Um, on the last stream, we actually thought about it. Uh, it seems like the Golden Hero has more max HP than the Dark Hero. And we were wondering why that might be. And we came to the conclusion that um, when the Dark Hero first came out, they actually nerfed his HP quite a bit. They would not have nerfed the the golden hero's hp because they never expected you to be able to get to the golden hero so they probably kept his hp the same and kept the dark hero's hp uh or nerfed the dark hero's hp so if it feels like this has more max hp it's probably because it does managed to win a run congrats dog now watch this drive in the famous words of george bush Even this hero feels like he has more HP. I, in fact, I think he does. Like, he, this guy's gonna get to ult. So, yeah, he definitely has more HP. So, I, I don't know. I consider that confirmation, personally. Like, to me, that's confirmation. I don't know about you guys. I'm sure some of you guys out there would prefer to see the actual HP values, but... Okay, I'm keeping my Mercury Hearts. I think that means I've officially got my Mojo back against this guy. Okay, there goes one. By this definition, even the Bone Omen has a cap? What do you mean? 9, 90%? Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah. 
So it has like a soft cap. Unless you're doing the inventory glitch with like that weird thing that um, Beals did that one time. We only lost one Mercury Art the whole time. Hooray! Do you see this run, by the way, Doss? Look at this shit. We got this, like, immediately. <laughs> Man, holy mother of God. What a run. Now how do I w uh, break this windscreen? I don't think there's a really good way to do it. The best I have is, like, uh, dark charging into the wall. Which is not very good, but it'll at least get me a little into the wall. Never mind, it did not get me into the wall at all. Eh, I guess it kind of did. GG's. G freaking G's. Fire O is good for real. Fire O is good. Definitely, you know, need mana tech, obviously. But, like, all of Mage's abilities, except for maybe the Meteors. I don't know. I'm not sold on the Meteors. But that was great. What an excellent run. Um, Yeah, man. Turns out, double 13th bone. Pretty good. The only thing that sucked about this run was the Mercury Hearts. But, like, once I got my Mojo, I was able to keep them pretty easily. Meteors are hot, literally. That's every mage skill though they're all hot but um i guess that's another mercury hearts run under my belt showing that i still got it even though i hate doing these runs i don't think they're very fun this was fun but like the average omen 3 run where you don't have like crazy damage scaling and you're just like dodging for your life constantly and like everything's just horrible like i don't know i'm not a fan of uh mercury heart runs so you very rarely see me do them I don't even know how I'm, how am I going to do this thumbnail. Oh god, I'm just imagining it. I don't know how to fit seven omens into one image. I'll have to think about it. That's a me problem. Not as hot as you? Wrong. I'd say Mage is, ho Mage is hotter than you. Admit it, Piplip. He's got that beard, bro. You can't compete with that beard. Looking at this list of omens, like, <laughs> two of them are, like, worthless. The the Misfortune Omen is dog shit, and the Idol is literally unawakened, so it doesn't do anything. But, um, the other omens are good. And also, the, the non-omen items we had are really good as well. Like, this is the kind of stuff you want. Our skulls were also really- Fugly got- fuck Oh my god, Automat is such a fucking wimp, bro. Courage also? It was doing stuff- until I got rid of my Courage 2. And even then it wasn't really doing much, I guess. It was only helping my basic attacks on my Paladin. So I guess that's three. Sure, I'll, I'll count three there. Overall, though, just an interesting run. You know, like, I, I already had a YouTube run that I thought I was going to put out tomorrow. But this one's, like, far more interesting. So I guess this is the YouTube video for tomorrow. Or today for you guys. <laughs> the, the recording time is weird with uh, my content release. But yeah, I think that's all I got. Don't want to uh, ramble too much on this outro, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. You're not going to see another Omen. Maybe you'll never see an Omen run for me again, actually, because what if I don't play the uh, the Dark Mirror after they release this new game mode? You know, what if? Make sure you pay the doubters. Will do. We'll see. Oh, you know what I just thought? It's, it's going to be interesting how... Um, how the uh, the Emperor, or whoever we're fighting, probably the Emperor, at the end of this um, Demon King Castle defense works. I wonder if we'll be able to port into the to the Emperor. Like, what if we can go to DM10 and port into the Emperor fight and, like, scale his HP up to, like, infinity, and he already has, like, ridiculous HP? Like, what if his HP is, like, enormous as it is, and then we add the DM10 multiplier onto it? Stop stalling? Okay. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate y'all, and I will see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.